As some of you may have heard, um, we've licensed the Anatomy Learning Outcomes for Medicine from the Anatomical Society and the Education Committee have very kindly formed an editorial board for us and with their help we've commissioned over 50 educators from around the world to come on board and help us create explanatory movies using our 3D models to explain everything that a medical student needs to understand about each of these learning outcomes. One of the major problems that students have is knowing the level of detail to uh, learn, that they need to know to learn anatomy. And when there is only a certain amount of time in the curriculum for students to study anatomy, it's important for them to know what to focus on. And the 156 learning outcomes are an attempt to give students a really clear idea of what they need to know um, on graduation and during their first house years. The learning outcomes will give them very specific and quite directed areas in which they can learn specific parts of anatomy. And I think that will be very helpful, again, as an adjunct to what we do in the classroom, but also to make it a little less daunting of this enormous subject anatomy and giving them something a bit more specific on which to concentrate. So I think learning outcomes are really important so that students know what's expected of them so that they can get an idea of the, the depth of knowledge that they need to have and take away from, from their learning um, and also for us in terms of developing teaching materials so that we know what it is we're aiming to get across to the students and to, to make things structured 